straight. Great fortune. Yes. Oh, Tabitha, here I am. If there's any single ladies. Here with the infamous. Okay, I am here with the infamous, actually maybe not so infamous, but famous Sheena at her own Sheena Metal Experience. Woo-woo! And we have somebody that's on the left, or I mean, my right, left, whatever, her right? Kate Doster. Yeah, stage left, whatever. Anyway, so I want to talk to you a little bit, not only about this experience, but what about this relationship here with Kate? What is that? What's oh, going on here? The photographer actress relationship? Yes, exactly. What's up with that? Yeah. yeah what is that? Uh, I don't normally like having my picture taken, but I feel safe with Kate, so it's okay if she takes my picture. And I and she's explained that it's a little deeper than that because you well, got this thing going on with Susan and now there's Kate. So what kind yeah, of relationship Kate, is this now? Oftentimes, right before the valet comes, Kate propositions me. I have. Oh, I'm sorry. And then Every time. and then runs in the car and leaves. Oh my I've gosh! So it's a hit and run. It's <laughs> kind of a hit and run. Kind of a quick hit and run. We did go to dinner we once. Jewish. Deli breakfast. Right, I'm Irish, so I didn't know oh. what any of the food was. Oh, okay. I was it looking was for a beer and a potato. Yes, and, and I uh, was looking to hook up. Yeah, and she spent a lot of time telling me how I was disappointing her because I was not being her hookup fantasy. Just a, a I, get bit. So, I get it. I get it. Yeah, she, she has high expectations. She does, and I'm a, she? I'm a terrible really. disappointment with my whole <laughs> workaholism and life. And, and, and how long have you actually known each other? August. Is that it? Was it the first no, time? No. Yes, we. I because I bought my house. It was right before the 20th uh, anniversary, and she's really great with her fan base, and she said, what's everybody doing on Monday? And I was like, shooting with snakes. <laughs> and so she wrote back, and she's like, I've shot with snakes. And the very like next hour, we opened a Netflix dialogue, and she's gotten me hooked on like everything on Netflix. I, I always go to her. I'm like, what are we watching now? And you know what? I the only I did thing, shoot with snakes. It's a true story. And the only thing that I remember from this now is that she talked about snakes, and then you talk about the vagina oh, monologue, okay. and then you have there the was not a snake in my vagina. Did, and I'm like, Just snakes so you know. and vaginas. No. I don't think uh, that goes tonight, together. Tonight, uh, my guest Robbie Riss made a reference to my first TV show that he was a part of. Okay. And one of my actresses who played my best friend, um, she had a snake named Batface. Except we called him Angus on the after Angus from uh, ACDC. <laughs> and he was the best actor I've ever worked with. Wow. Except one time we were doing a photo session in a Catholic church parking lot without <laughs> asking permission. Ooh. And he decided to crawl off her head and crawl into a radiator grill in a parched car. And we kept trying to get him out before oh, the no. Monsignor came. <laughs> and the Monsignor came and asked us what we were doing. And one of my cast members, who was a drag queen in eight inch <laughs> club kid boots, had been his altar boy and had to make some kind of a little deal so we didn't all go to jail. Wow. That was a loaded it involved question. Vaseline. Yikes. Yeah, that was a totally loaded question that I had no idea That's we were going to go snakes. down that path. That like is. the Catholic Church and snakes yeah. and vaginas. And that day was and easier than um, rebutting the... all of Kate's advances. <laughs> <laughs> I, I would like to ask a, I'd like yes. to ask a question on camera that last year after Corey Feldman felt my butt and for the anniversary, which okay. I love. Because all sentences start with last year <laughs> yes. after Corey Feldman Felt felt my, my butt. Yes. Um, Sheena mentioned that I could come back and shoot the celebrity version of Vagina Monologues, which I have never seen. Right, which I do every year. Okay. And I would like to confirm on tape in front no. of God and the whole world that you know right. that. Yes, this year, March and April. Oh, amazing. Mm -hmm. Wow, that's great. And you guys should come too. Oh, totally. Oh. But I'm, oh. I'm still not having sets of Kate. <laughs> oh. All right, well, well, We've got, we'll be tonight. Your bodyguards. How about that? Yeah, yeah. you guys protect like me. For tonight. Yeah. <laughs> that hurts yeah, my I know, exactly. So we'll, wa we'll yeah. watch. Yeah, because last time she drugged me. <laughs> <laughs> and I, I woke up in a truck stop <laughs> in, uh, in Booth, Tonopah, Booth. Arizona. Oh, co yeah. Covered in KY. Wow. I have no, I, I have no idea how, how I got there. <laughs> I don't know. My clothes were gone. Memories. You know, <laughs> all, all I got was a free cactus <laughs> and a, two pieces of fried chicken. And well, there was a that potato wedge beautiful. involved. Yeah. Or was that a wedgie? I'm not sure. And, I, and, I, and I, so I had to buy a t-shirt that said, this is Arizona and we like fucking guns here. <laughs> and I had to wear it back to California. And three so liberal amazing. vegans kicked me. Yeah. Because they yeah, wouldn't you know. believe it wasn't my shirt. Yeah. I, oh, I totally so can understand that. There, yes. Things can be misinterpreted. Yeah. But I do have so to. So I don't really know if I had sex with Kate or not. <laughs> hey. I'm not sure. You I don't. That know. whole weekend was fuzzy. I'm just saying. Yeah, but but really I know that fuzzy, she sent yeah. me an apology for no reason. <laughs> I think it came with a fruitcake. I was out shopping for. <laughs> 
Well, the I bar. have to say, it was awesome to see the I'm glad you had fun. on yeah. stage. It, I mean, I love Good. radio and I love like talk shows and things like that. And to see the relationship that you have with yeah. all the people that were there and then you know how they talk about you it's just it's an thank honor you. for me to be here thank you to cover this it's an honor but, for me to have you both here but to really see the power in the influence of doing things what i'm going to say right regardless of what everybody thank else you. wants to have an opinion on what you're doing i see is right for the industry so thank i you. Appreciate that because it's refreshing, and Thank that's you. what I told you know Susan. It's all also. about friends. Most of the audience are my friends. My listeners are my friends. My Facebook friends are my friends. Um, every one of those guests, the photographer is my friend. I thought that was covered. <laughs> <laughs> I need a little validation. I'm sorry. Uh, uh, everybody on that stage is a friend. I'm yeah. honored that they would come here. And when I listen to them talk and I hear how magic they are and I hear how an audience responds to them, I think I must be doing something right to have yes. beautiful people like that in my life. Yes. And, and it, I mean, it's a true testament. And like I said, I'm honored to be here. And congratulations. Thank you. And this. thank you for having me. Please come again. Oh, definitely. Come with my oh, vagina yeah, talks, oh, March yes, and April. We definitely want to do Don't that. kidnap me. I don't want to wake up okay, at a truck stop again. <laughs> I'll get you my card. All right. Thank you. A straight Great fortune. Yes. Oh, Tabitha, here I am. If there's any single ladies. Here, with the infamous 